In this film, you are on a horse. And was that, again, was your idea? Was it another vision? Yes, I had another vision. <laughs> After chapter two, John Wick is running out of Central Park, and I said, Chad, I have a vision. And he was like, what, Keanu? And I said, I want to ride a horse. Why don't I ride a horse? I'm trying to escape. And so he said, that's a good idea. <laughs> and so began the training, because with John Wick, you can't just ride a horse. You have to come off the saddle. You're supposed to fall under it, hold onto the pommel. Excuse me. It's fine. And then shoot some guns. <laughs> um, but, uh, but, but when we were training, I, I couldn't really do it, and I fell. Um, but as you do, and so then they had to create something to make it safe, and so they did this contraption that was like this truck with some beams and then a gentleman on a wire, so I was picked <clears throat> in case I fell off the horse while we were on the streets. And um, so that happened a couple of times. The horse took off and I was like falling and then they pulled me up and... Wow. But uh, so that was nice. I tell you who wouldn't have liked this. But it's fun. Jamie Bell. Oh, you're not no. you're not a fan of the horse. I, I did listen, I didn't love horses. Me and horses didn't particularly get along, Graham. Um, like I'd be walking through a, I mean not randomly walking through a field, but like I'd be <laughs> close to a horse and it'd be like, oh no, I'm not uh, no, that guy's giving me energy and it would like run away because it would feel my <clears throat> fear. I was yeah. terrified of them. You know, they're we, big and they're unpredictable. We've, ne we've never connected over this. I was I was thrown from one on the set of Robin Hood. Oh you were? And yeah. I, I I got to a whole movie about Robin Hood and I never once got on a horse on camera. Yeah. Because wait, wait, is that wait, true? Is that, is that actually... You were never on horseback? I was never on a horse in that film. Where? What? Because yeah. I, couldn't, I couldn't bear to... I couldn't be within, like, ten metres yeah. of them. Because yeah. once I was thrown off, I was... Oh, I'm, right, yeah, petrified. sure. Well, now, but then you yeah. should talk to Jamie... Because you had a special... Was it a woman or a, a person, anyway? Her name is Camilla Napruce, and she does... She, she does the kind of horse mastery on a lot of uh, films. She's the horse master on Game of Thrones. Like, she's, she's done everything. And she has a very specific technique, which is just kind of like strap you onto the horse. <laughs> and she's with you on another horse. And she just kind of starts going like, I don't really like this at all. And then she goes quicker and quicker. You're like, no, seriously, stop. And then she'll ask you incredibly personal questions about your life. How was your father? Well, tell me about your father. Like, what do you feel most guilty about? And then ultimately you're like, I don't, I've never met him. Um, I don't know. <laughs> School, I put, took cigarettes to school and my teacher let me off. Like, and you realise I've totally forgotten about horse riding. That's... And it, it was a crazy kind of therapeutic, um, amazing way of learning to ride a horse. I don't, I, yeah, it so was you will ride different. A you ride a horse. I love riding horses now. I, I went to her like every week after that. I uh, see. I never would have admitted riding. that I won't ride horses <laughs> had I known that his story. <laughs> <ended>. <laughs> 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 There you go. Ha <laughs> ha.